It's been a quiet year for Sony's camera lineup, but rumors suggest that things may finally change this November. After a long wait, the camera giant preparing to release the Sony A12, a successor to its flagship A1, which last saw an update in March 2021. The A1's impressive specs initially set it apart as one of Sony's top performers, and fans are curious about what Sony might add in a follow-up model. Alongside the A12, rumors of the Sony A7 V and the A7S IV have also been circulating, making this a potentially exciting season for Sony fans. Let's start with the headliner the Sony A12. This flagship model, if it arrives, would need to bring major upgrades to justify its place above the already high-performing Sony A93, released in November 2023. The A93 took over as Sony's top high-speed option, with its prowess in action and wildlife photography. So, if Sony releases the A12, it would need to carve out its space by building on the A1's already formidable 50MP full-frame sensor. 8K video capabilities, and advanced AF systems. One of the speculated improvements is dual processors, potentially elevating its shooting speed and processing power beyond what the A1 originally offered. The current A1 has proven its reliability for both high-resolution stills and 8K video, so an A1 II would likely aim to maintain that versatility while addressing areas like low-light performance and video stabilization. Many expect Sony to bolster the A12's autofocus even further to match the A93's speed but with higher resolution ideal for sports and wildlife shooters who also need detailed, high-resolution images. A stronger sensor, possibly with improved dynamic range and a wider native ISO range, would certainly put the A12 in a league of its own. Rumor has it that Sony might also focus on making the A12 a powerhouse for videographers. The original A1 set a high bar with 8K at 30fps, and Sony could potentially add 8K 60fps or even push into the world of 6K or 4K RAW recording for a more flexible editing workflow. For those already using the A1, these updates could provide more flexibility for capturing content in various lighting conditions and with a broader range of shooting styles. If true, these upgrades would position the A1 II as a flagship not just for photographers, but for filmmakers too. While the A12 is expected to headline any potential announcement, it's worth taking a closer look at the other two rumored models, the A7 V and A7S IV. The A7 IV has been a beloved all-rounder since its December 2021 release, celebrated for its blend of excellent photo and video capabilities. However, competitors like Nikon's Z63 and Canon's EOS R6 Mark II have overtaken the A7 IV in recent years. An A7 V could help Sony reclaim its edge in this versatile, hybrid space. If the A7 V does arrive, it's likely to build on the A7 IV's solid 33 megapixel sensor, perhaps pushing even further in terms of low light capability and autofocus performance. Video enthusiasts would also expect to see enhancements in 4K recording quality and possibly new frame rate options for slow motion footage. With its user friendly handling and balanced design, the A7 V would be aimed at photographers and videographers looking for a capable, high-quality camera that's not quite in the flagship price range. The A7S IV, on the other hand, would focus on video, following in the footsteps of the A7S III, which won fans with its strong low-light performance and 4K 120fps recording. An A7S IV could make strides in improving internal video codecs, offering 6K recording, or providing even greater low-light sensitivity. The A7S series has always been known for excelling in low-light scenarios, so any updates to the A7S IV would likely reinforce that reputation, making it a go-to option for videographers who often work in challenging lighting. Alongside these potential camera releases, there are also rumors for a new lens specifically a Sony FE 2470M f2 GM lens. If Sony does reveal this lens, it would be the first 2470M with a constant f2 aperture, adding a new level of creativity for photographers who need a fast, versatile zoom. This would go up against Canon's RF 2870M ftwo, but with a slightly wider field of view. For photographers who want a high-performing, wide aperture zoom, this could be the ultimate glass to pair with a Sony full-frame camera.
Several sources have marked November 19 or 20 as the date for Sony's big reveal, set to happen at New York's Creative Space event. Sony has previously used this event to launch significant products, and with the quiet year they've had, a new camera announcement seems plausible. That said, it's worth remembering that Sony has been known to shift its plans based on internal priorities or market conditions. If Sony's November announcement includes the A12, it could be an exciting moment for fans of high-end, high-performance cameras. For those more focused on versatility or video, the A7 V or A7 S4 could also deliver exactly what they're looking for. So what do you think? Let us know in the comments below and thanks for watching.